Hello, Sapir YMCA. I am Jen, your Health and Wellness Director, and I am here with Ashley and Jill, and we have Kayla and Chris with us here today as well. Um, we're just here to say hi and talk to you guys and um, show you how you can donate to the Y today. So I'm going to turn it over to uh, Chris, and you can fill us in. Well, thanks, Jen. Hello, everybody. And uh, I just want to start with a couple of things that uh, we really miss you at the Y. We miss being there. We miss seeing you. Um, but I'd really like to thank this group uh, with, with Jen and Jill and Ashley for putting together these awesome virtual experiences. I know for, for me and for my wife and our, our kids, we've been able to utilize them. And we, we like to laugh and joke and, and tease each other and have fun. But this has been a real uh, a real blessing and a real saving grace for, for me and my family um, to get both that, that mental and physical uh, release and, and opportunity to, uh, to step away from COVID and everything else that, that's going on. And um, so thank you three for putting these things together. I think I counted 42 or 43 of these things, which is awesome. Uh, our, our doors have been shut for about 30 days. So we're averaging more than obviously more than one a day. And so there's, there's something out there for everyone. So thank you for that. I really want to thank our members too. Um, it's going to be hard for me to not get emotional here, but um, in our darkest times, when, when we had to close our doors to you, um, that, that was the hardest thing that, that I've had to do professionally um, to walk away for, for whatever period of time this ends up being. And so many of you reached out and, and lifted us up. And I know that we feel that through these videos. Um, your participation in, in that lifts us up, lifts up this crew, and um, and you did that for me, and I'm 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 forever grateful for that. Many of you, um, when we closed our doors, just reached out personally and said, you know, you're doing the right thing, and um, and we'll be here, and we'll be back when when you come back, and that that means the world to us. Um, it really does, and so wanted to talk a little bit more about um, about ways that you might be able to help. Um, the biggest ask that we're making right now is really to stay with us as members. We are still drafting. Um, and if you don't want to be drafted, um, you can really easily um, put a hold on your membership or cancel. We understand those things. We know that uh, many of you are going through difficult times um, and, and jobs are lost and all those sorts of things. So if you need to do that, we certainly understand and you can, you can do that through our website. But we are asking that if you're able to, that you stay with us as members. And that's really the biggest ask that we can make. Our costs, a lot of them continue. We have all of our full-time people working and, and some part-time folks. We still have cleaning company that comes in and, and is doing some deep cleaning in our building and, and getting us ready um, to reopen. Um, things like maintenance, things like finance, things like membership, all those things are, are still occurring. And so we have our, our full-time team intact. You know, our utilities don't stop. Um, we still pay insurance and all those things. And obviously any, any business that um, has to shut its doors for any period of time uh, is, is experiencing a significant hardship. And, and the why is, is no different. You know, we're gonna be okay. Um, we're gonna come through on the other end, but we are looking for support at this time. So staying with us, if you can, you can also give to the COVID relief fund, which um, is on our website, really easy to find. Um, and obviously those funds are just gonna give us operational um, help at this time. Um, and, and finally, annual support campaign. And I think everyone has probably heard about that. We're utilizing those dollars right now um, in childcare. So we've closed our doors to you as, as you normally see it, but we've opened our doors and we're very much in business to serve the needs of our community around healthcare. And we're really proud to be a part of the part of the fight against COVID in serving those essential working families. And so um, we've got people that have to go to work, of course, and are doing important work. And, and we've got those kids in our child care and we're supporting many of those families with dollars from our annual support campaign. That's a cost that, um, especially with school age kids, that those families didn't anticipate. Um, all of our kids would normally be in school right now. And if they're not, and you need to work, a lot of them need to be in childcare. And so people are, are dealing with that additional burden. Um, we're doing some other fun things too. We are reaching out to, uh, to our seniors. Obviously we're doing uh, the virtual opportunities and connecting that way. But um, if you need someone to talk to, please, please reach out. Reach out to this group, get someone's email off of our, 
uh, website. We want to talk to you. We miss you, and and we want to be there in any way that we can. Um, again, annual support campaign. That's going to uh, help us help others um, when we reopen. And and like I said, now through childcare. But when we come back, we're going to continue to give financial assistance um, for membership, for programming, um, for all those things. We we never want finances to keep someone away from the Y or out of a Y program. And so. If you find yourself, um, you know, at the end of this or when we reopen, uh, in those circumstances, we want to help. We want to help you too. So make sure that you ask for that help if if you're um, like so many dealing with uh, loss of income and those sorts of things. So um, I'll leave it at that, Jen. And uh, just again, miss you all and look forward to seeing you soon. Thank you, Chris. Um, I would like to have Kayla here kind of share her screen. She's going to pull up our website and how easy it is to find that uh, donate button and just kind of walk us through that process here for you guys as well. So Kayla, take it over. Absolutely. Here, I'll share my screen and I'll pull up <coughs> our Superior YMCA website. If you've not been to our website before, it is superiorymca.org. This is our main screen. Feel free to look at this video that the Y of the USA put out with Stay With Us. It's a very powerful video. You can click off that and here you'll see our main screen. Our donation tab is over here on the top under social responsibility and there you will see our giving page for the COVID-19 response fund and our annual support campaign. So you can click on this one here. This brings this page up in just a minute. Here you are. And then down here you can select your amount. These are pre-given tabs or you can put in your own amount there. Um, mm -hmm. You can also dedicate your donation and you can fill out your information here, your phone number, leave a comment. Um, here you can fill out your payment information. Um, and then you can click give and then it goes directly to us. Every dollar donated stays with the Spirit YMCA and right into our community. So um, there you have it. Let me go back to our website. Excellent. Perfect. So um, I would just like to kind of finish up and just say thank you guys for all of your um, support through this time being at home as well. Um, the emails that I constantly get, the feedback on the videos um, is amazing every single day. So thank you for your support and sticking with us through this time. We miss you. We can't wait to see you guys again soon. Um, and post some comments in the bottom of this video as well, what you um, are looking to see more from us. And if you have any questions about donating to the Y, um, or anybody you would like to talk to, I can easily connect you with anybody's emails as well. So thank you guys. We hope to see you again soon. Have a great rest of your day. Get outside, enjoy that sunshine, and keep smiling. We'll see you soon. Bye.